so the Ukrainian and I think it's uh, billions of, of uh, US dollars. Basically what we are saying to our European partners uh, who made this dramatic mistake being so reliant on Russian energy, Russian gas and Russian oil and, and Russian coal, we are part of a solution because we offer you our resources and our electricity and time will come then, then Ukraine will start exporting natural gas because we have huge, huge uh, deposits and, and this is what we are doing. We have drop of consumption by more than 35% as of today and it brings us to over capacity of, uh, of uh, our power generation. Also we, we maintain uh, coal production, gas production at pre-war level and it brought us to a situation when we are not asking for electricity from Europe but offering electricity and we will start exporting electricity I, I believe from the next month. So they kill, they destroy, and then they show nice pictures how, how they have. Just four hours before war started, we disconnected from Belarusian, from Russia. And I think we will never reconnect back to that. On 16th of March, we connected to European grid. And now we are part of, of European energy system. And this is an example of real European integration of, of Ukraine, even during the war. They, they, they try to bring electricity from Russia and they try to, to restore. First, they damage. Our energy system synchronized, but it was synchronized in emergency, in emergency mode, which do not allow us to get commercial revenue out of export of, of uh, electricity. And now it should be uh, unlocked. Now Ukraine uh, need, needs this revenue to support financial stability of our energy system and we, we have to be allowed to export electricity now. My staying in this company and being in, in energy, we will not be buying any fuels or electricity from, from Russia. Station to other uh, cities where we operate.